aggression and rock and roll. They've both been around a very long time. So it was inevitable that they meet. I think the Beatles and the Rolling Stones have made a very big contribution to fashion rock and roll. I'm sure everything I go in there will blow my mind as soon as I get in. Rock style pushes to the limit the examination of the role of popular culture in fashion. We played music to piss our parents off, and I think we're still doing it with the clothes. I've been working very closely with these costumes of the rock artists. They've sort of become like friends. Music and fashion kind of go together. I think that the fans like their entertainers to be fashionable and to look good. If you're into the grunge music and you have that comfortable kind of fashion sense or you're a glam rocker or whatever you are. Rock style for many years has had an influence on fashion designers. I know when I started my business I was influenced by rock stars dress and I think that now rock stars are influenced by fashion designers as well so really it's a joining at the hip. Oh, Mick has always been a great inspiration to me. As a matter of fact, he is uh, probably the one rock star who has made more of an impression on, uh, on fashion than anyone else because he has always been dangerous, he's always been irreverent, he's always stepped out, he's always changing, and uh, he's had a tremendous influence over the world of fashion. The Beatles were probably more influential than any other rock group initially and uh, certainly being able to display the Sgt. Pepper's costumes is very important. They really were the first to uh, wear uniforms in a sense and then the Temptations and all the Motown groups did the same. It started with what we could afford and then when it started wearing off we'd rip it off and I'd hang it on my mic stand and when I met my wife Teresa she made things like these pants, the pink suit that's in there and so it's like, you know, it's in there, it's like Prego. Music, rock and roll, it should be a great millennium moment when there's a lot of just fun and sparkle. I don't think we should take fashion too seriously, so it's got to be kind of going to a temple. They really complement each other. They have really brought us forward. They're cutting edge, they're different, they're new, they're challenging and exciting. I know, I can never walk the runway into the shows I've not done without music. It's definitely inspiration in my life. It gives you the rhythm, it sends the energy out, and it is what it is today. I couldn't live without music. The music is ultimately the most important aspect. Second most important, or uh, right up there, is, uh, is how they look.